When I was a teenager, I dyed my hair purple, but now that I'm all grown up, ish, I found less ostentatious ways to express my individuality. Cannondale are a bit like that too, and after many years of pushing some pretty wild concepts, they've toned it down a little bit. They're all a little bit more practical now, and we like it. Monza Imports, the Aussie Cannondale distributor, just held their 2019 show, and this bike in particular really grabbed our attention, along with a few others that we can't show you yet until the embargo lifts. Cannondale have joined the crop of brands producing a 29er version of their big travel rig with the new Jekyll 29. Earlier this year we reviewed the 275 wheeled version of this bike and it was a refreshing machine, a real symbol of Cannondale's new direction in mountain bikes. The 29er shares all the same features but with slightly less travel and bigger, faster wheels. At the heart of the bike is the Gemini Shock which is an adapted version of the Fox Float X. Hitting the remote lever on the bars alters the air volume of the shock and therefore the amount of travel. You can run it in a flow mode of 150mm out back or engage the hustle mode with the travel getting chopped to 120mm with a firmer spring rate and less sag which gives the bike better climbing geometry. While the geometry charts only tell part of the story, it should be a plow machine. The 65 degree head angle and 445 mil stays should make it more stable than a Botoxed brow line. There will be two versions of the Jekyll 29 coming to Australia and you can bet your cornhole that we will be getting one of these onto our trails ASAP for a full review.